Hello friends! I'm glad to see you on my channel and today I want to show you my yoga for calm mind. I had a very stressful week and I got a little sick. So I suggest starting our yoga with the breathing exercises. Breathe in, hands up. Breathe out, hands down. Now we will take our tension off the neck. Smooth tilts of the head to the sides. Then down and up. If you also had a difficult week, then you will now feel how this exercise helps to get rid of the accumulated tension in the neck. Now we move on to stretching our arms. Just stretch your arm along the body and press it with the other hand. And now I'm proposed to do a useful exercise for the wrists. Form a fist and make a circular motion with your hand in a different direction. This is a very useful exercise that should not be underestimated. I recommend doing this exercise before the cat cow yoga pose because there is a lot of stress on the wrists. And now we are moving on to another useful and simple exercise for the spine. I call it back waves. These movements improve the mobility and flexibility of the spine. It's very beneficial for good posture. We are going to do 10 reps. Do as much flexion in your back as you can. On the inhale we flex as if we are timing on the inhale we round our back strongly and rise don't think about anything focus your attention on your sensations in the body We are great! Sit for a few seconds after this exercise and observe how you feel in your body. Then slowly move your body in different directions. You are lucky, because my yoga today is for lazy people. Most of the exercises will be done lying on your back. But believe me, you will really do useful things for your body. So take a position lying on your back. Lift your legs up and then slowly begin to bend your legs alternately. Mm -hmm. 
No thoughts. We release tension and all stress from our body. Now we do the exercise based on our feelings without thinking about anything. Now we will stretch our feet. We will perform slow circular movements of the feet in one direction and in the other. Now we will put our feet on any heel so that they are harder than our body and lie down and breathe for 15 seconds. Now we will stretch our glutes Bend your leg and place the other leg on top of the bent leg. Pull your legs towards you. This is a very nice and lazy stretch. Try swaying from one side to the other and observe how your body feels. And then switch legs. The next exercise is a circular motion of the leg. We are going to stretch our hip flexor. Make five circular movements to the one side, then to the other. Now bend your leg and pull it towards your belly. Lie in this position for a few seconds. And then unbend your leg and pull it toward you as far as possible. Here you can also continue to knead the foot. If you hear a crunch in the hip flexor, don't worry, it's normal. Just do it slowly and don't forget to breathe. Let's stretch the glutes of this leg again. I love this exercise because you can do it lying down. You can even do it in your bed. Now pull the leg towards you. Gently, you don't have to keep your leg straight here. You can bend it at the knee. Concentrate on your breathing and with each exhalation try to pull your leg closer to your chest. Then we gently bend the leg and lay like that for 15 seconds.
Let's refine our pose a little bit. And let's wrap our arms around our legs like this and lie in this position for a few more seconds. Let's refine our pose a little bit. Let's wrap our arms around our legs like this. And lie in this position for a few more seconds. This is a very useful yoga pose. And it also stretches the legs and hips. Let's move our feet a bit and watch how the body feels. Now we will hug our knees and sway from the side to side. It's very beneficial for the spine and lower back. I would even call it back massage. Now we'll perform a rather difficult exercise. I will show you two options. First I will show you an option for beginners and unprepared people. Repeat after me. If you feel that you can try more, Repeat after me and try to lower yourself and lie on your back. The quadriceps stretch very well here. The main condition is also to try to pull your lower back to the floor and not to bend it. Gently pull your legs out and put your arms around them. Line this position for a while to calm your legs after the stretching and then lift your legs up. These are very simple but useful exercise for the foot and to refresh blood circulation in the legs. Move feet a little to improve their mobility and flexibility. That was my last exercise of 15 minute relaxation yoga class. I hope you're feeling much better and see you soon.